is up you guys? We are back at it, only eating fast food restaurants in the South for 24 hours. Things are about to get crazy because this place behind me for breakfast almost looks like it'd be better for one of the sketchy restaurants. But to not say anymore, let's go try this place. So I am here with my lovely girlfriend, say hey. And we are gonna be going at this. Have you had this fast food spot before? Yes. And wh what is it like? Is it good fast food, bad fast food? It's really a lot of fried food. Oh God, that <laughs> sigh before. I don't know if I'm excited. So let's check out this menu, shall we? They got some corn brains. Or corn brains. Beans and cornbread for $2.99. That's a good deal. They got biscuits for a dollar or three dollars. Sandwiches, man, they got it all here. You can even get an Uncrustable combo with cookie and medium drink for $3.99. What's an Uncrustable? Oh, what, like a little pee pee yeah. in here? Oh my goodness. <laughs> hey there, how are you? Yeah, how are you good, good. Can we get um, some cheddar munchers, country ham biscuit, then I want to get a uh, bologna biscuit. Is that possible? Yeah, we can do that. Can I get a bologna And then the beans and cornbread? Yeah. Yeah. How about a fire and ice pickle? Yeah. Beans and cornbread with onions. And then a fire and ice pickles? Do they have fried pickles? What is a fire? Drink? What is a fire and ice pickle? Oh, it's like the sweet and uh, sweet pickles with a little bit of kick to them. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, do you they guys have fried have, pickles? Do you guys have fried pickles still? We don't. Fried don't. mac and cheese bites. Fried mac and cheese bites. We don't. Oh, okay. Um, let's just yeah, let's get those pickles. Is the order fire and ice pickles? Then a sprite. And a sprite. You want that one? Yes, please. We're sharing, baby. Cash or card? Card. Dang, all that food for twenty-three dollars, you guys. Man, I love the South. We also have our little guy in the back. Goop He's goop. chilling. See, he wants buckies. Thank you very much. Awesome. Thank you. All right. We got the things, let's go check them out. So we got our food, let's check this out, all right? All right, so right here are our cheddar munchers. They basically look like little tater tots. There's probably cheese inside. We got a whole baggie of them. Next thing we got is one of our biscuits. Let's check it out. Oh, baby, which was yeah. that, the country ham right there? That's mine. Ah, why do I get the bologna? Unless it's fried bologna, I'll trade you. It is fried. The next one. Oh, oh baby, look at this saucer biscuit right there. Ain't nothing better than a fried bologna biscuit. What else should you get? Cornbread and beans. Oh, wow. Okay, so then we got an order of corn bread and baked beans. For breakfast. For breakfast, but look at that cornbread. Mmm. Mmm, I do love cornbread. We do love a little cornbread. All right, last but not least. Oh, this was not what I was expecting. Fire and this ice. This is fire and ice pickles. Let's look at them. Oh, baby. Oh, my god. Literally, gosh. this is going to be something else. All right, let's get to this, okay? So the moment we've all been waiting for, let's start trying some of this food. I say we start with the cornbread before we get into our sandwiches. Okay. Take a bit. Let's put it in our beans. Let's see what this is all about. <laughs> oh, it tastes like a whole bunch of onions. <laughs> Let me try just some of the beans. Those aren't baked beans, them are plain beans. Some onions. They ain't sweet not at all. Not big on beans. Them are not good. Ooh. Them are gotta be the worst baked beans I ever had in my life. They have no flavor to them. It's like right out of a can. Oh my gosh, no wonder it's $2.99. Yeah, it makes sense. They, they saving money on all the seasonings. Ugh. Let's try these cheddar munchers and let's see what these all about. Oh, show that to the camera. Straight cheese on the inside, fried outer rim. Nice little potato. potato crunch. These are definitely a quick, good bite. My only question is, how do they get the cheese inside? With Syringe? The potato. I don't know. I don't know, but them is good. So I will say, on your country ham sandwich, they barely gave you any ham at all. Yeah. It looks like they threw a little beef jerky into a biscuit and they said, enjoy. I might me just take off all the biscuit. Me on the other hand, I got a freaking Frisbee in mine. Not that good. All right, here goes nothing. <laughs> Tastes like gas station food. This, it's burnt. Yeah, it's burnt to a brisk. Oh. This is no good, guys. I think this place Let's might try. be a one and done. -er. So these are definitely a one and done. You take a couple of bites. Look, this isn't doing any any kind of honor to Southern fast food. But don't worry because later in this video we're gonna hit three or four more spots to make up for this one crappy one. So lastly, to finish this off, because we're here, let's try a spicy fire and ice pot pickle. Come on, baby. You go ahead. Come on, darling. It's gonna be spicy. Let's try it. 
That's probably the best thing on the menu. <laughs> Not spicy at all. It's a sweeter pickle Ooh. with a little bit of a kick to it, <clears throat> but it is nice and fire and ice. It's cold pickles. Well, it's sweet pickles. Yeah, sweet, but they're ice cold. Let's quickly rate this place one out of 10. What would you give it? Be honest, don't be nice. I know you're a Southern guy. Probably like a four. That's way too nice. <laughs> I'm gonna give this place a solid 2.9. No bueno for me, but let's keep you're it moving. We don't need that sauce. The sauce ain't you gonna gotta save it. You gotta try it. It's <laughs> the, the Bucky sauce. The sauce ain't gonna save nothing. Even the sauce sucks, okay? We're moving on. We got a lot more fast food spots to hit here in East Tennessee, so let's get to it. Come on. All right, you guys, it's lunchtime, and the next spot we have here is Pals. So let's go see what this is all about. This is also a drive through only, so let's get back in the truck. Come on. Pals, what do we get? Strawberry milkshake, please. A sauce burger with cheese. Wasn't there like a corn dog you wanted or something? A hot dog, no onion. Chili. It, it comes with chili on it. With chili on it? Do you want mustard on the hot dog? Yes. Yes, please. And then I'm gonna do the big pal with bacon and cheese. Anything else, y'all? Uh, Frenchie fry. And a Frenchie fry. You don't have chipped ham and cheese? Oh, the chipped ham and cheese? Yeah, yeah. yeah we do have that. Okay, I'm well. not sure how we have like bags of chips. Oh, no, no, no. Chipped ham and cheese. <laughs> yeah. And that's all. Yeah. All righty, you guys, so I have some company here for this one. This is Clark, this is Chessie, this is my lovely girlfriend, Kara, and we're gonna be eating Pals. So tell me about Pals, guys. Fast food from our hometown, been around for a long time. The actual founder met one of the founders of McDonald's many years ago. They had a very similar idea, and here we are. It's one of the most popular fast food chains in the South. Is it mainly here in Tennessee, or is it elsewhere in the I South? I think it's just Tennessee. It's just Tennessee. Mainly Tennessee. Okay, so we got something in front of us. This is like what your guys' is in and out or? This would be our in and out but Okay, okay. let's check it out. Let's see what we're working with here. So first thing we got, this is Clark's <laughs> special right here. Yeah, chili dog. <laughs> let's see this thing all together. Oh my. Grease galore. Slappy. <laughs> it's not grease, it's chili. Oh, wow. Chili. Very uh, meaty chili. It's yeah, the best. It looks like very grinded up chili. Almost like dog food chili, but damn it, it probably tastes good. Give me that dog. Here's your dog, boy. <laughs> All right, next thing we got. This one is the lovely Chessie's right here. Okay, so Chessie ordered, what was this? Sauce? This is a sauce burger with cheese. Sauce burger with cheese. Let's Can't see Can't go wrong. Let's see that. Oh, oh my. If you like sauce, you'd like this burger. Let me tell you, good <laughs> lord. So the next one, I, she was confused when I was ordering it. I'm confused on what a chipped ham and cheese is. So let's see it. I'm gonna have to have a bite of that one too. Yeah, that actually looks pretty good. Let's open that up. Oh, mm -hmm. good lord. Is that mayonnaise? Ham, mayonnaise, pickles, pickles. cheese. I don't know why, but my mouth is watering right my now. My mouth's watering too. <laughs> and last but not least, this one here is mine. I got the Pals bacon and cheese. This is a big pal. Yeah. Oh, wow. Big, big pal, pal, big pal, that's right. Big pal with cheese. Double the patty. That is a big Look at that. A royale with right cheese. There. Oh, I should have said no mayo. That's gonna be something else, but look it, maybe I like it. That's a good looking tomato though. And then we got some classic all French fries. So first let's start classic. down the the Frenchy fry. The Frenchy fry. My it's got bad. special seasoning, special seasoning. Does it? Okay, let's all taste a French fry. I'll take one. Mmm, they're like McDonald's fries. What? Oh, but with a little more seasoning. This is way better than McDonald's. Yeah. It does have a little, like, what is that seasoning? Cajun. That's good. Cajun. Not enough. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's start down the row. You can't go to Pals without getting a milkshake. Yeah, we got two of them. Cheers to Pals. Cheers. Woo. Let's try this Southern fast food. Oh my gosh. That's a pretty good burger. So good. That one's really good. It has a lot of yeah. mayo in it, but it gives a good flavor, some, surprisingly. And the meat is very thick so in these good. pal burgers. The big pal's the best. Mm, the pickles in this are nice. All right, here you go, Brennan. Oh man. Here's that meaty. Here's the chipped ham and mm -hmm. cheese. Listen, people right. always give me crap on the videos because we all, people, like me and my brother, share food. Oh. Everybody shares food. Yeah. Right? I'm, I'm about to take a, a bite of, oh, there's a beard hair in here. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm, that chili is to die for. Chili is pretty good. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. On a cold day like today, that chili hits nice. Look at this. A little too nice. I got I got mayo oh, all no. over my Foodie University shirt. By the way, everybody check it out. Clark's repping the bathroom reviews that you guys can get. BrennanTaylor.com. Show the back. Damn, I gotta go. All I gotta say is for a fast food spot, 
I wouldn't compare it to In-N-Out being a California native, but I think it's very tasty in its own realm. Like I wouldn't put it in the same realm as In-N-Out. It's not better than In-N-Out, but it's like better than your classic McDonald's and Burger King. Yeah. Good stuff. Oh yeah. Check out the best. You gotta try your uh, milkshake. I did take a little sip of this. So look how bright and vibrant that pink is in here. They said let's dip a fry. So how about that? Oh wow, look at them colors, y'all. Let's dip a fry in here and let's see what it's all about. Them shakes are not just like a Wendy's Frosty. Mm. This is like, they were making these in the back over there. Oh my mm. gosh, it's so good. Let's rate Pals, okay? One to 10, what do you guys give it? Start with you. I mean, it's always an, at least an 8.5, usually a nine. I agree. I can't come to Tennessee without getting Pals. Okay. It's not possible. I give it a 9.9, .9. I love Pals. Wow. And for someone who just tried Pals, I'm gonna give it a solid 8.5. Ah. It's pretty good, pretty good for, you know, fast food. I like that a lot. But look at look what we see right in front of us. What do you guys say we grab one more lunch meal, snack, if you will? Yep. Let's hit another spot. All right, you guys, it is snack time and we have Petro's. It's Petro's, man, oh, come on. My bad, Petro's, Petro's, whatever. Let's have a snack and let's go on in Dude, there. Dude, hurry on, hurry let's on, Let's try man. some chili. I come gotta on. get to the bathroom, I gotta oh. go. He's gotta, I gotta go, go. He's, he might, he, look, he's an honorary bathroom man. reviewer today. That pal's milkshake's got me going. Thank you, sir. Let's go. What a cute little restaurant. Very, very nice. What do you need? What do you want? Oh, let's get the classic. What, yeah. what is the most classic thing? Um, the Petro. Just a fully so, loaded perfect. classic That's what we're going for. Let's get that Petro with everything in it, right guys? Okay, you want a small, medium, or large? Um, let's do a large. Okay, do you like olives or jalapenos? Yeah. Okay. That is all. Okay. Well, I guess you've got to try uh, a Petro's tea. Yeah, okay. Get the orange tea. Let's get the Petro's orange tea. Do you want a large? Yeah, let's get a large. Is that gonna be all for you? Yeah, that's all. All right, I'm excited to try my first Petros. Petro, Petro, whatever. Let's try it. Well, I've eaten way too much. I've gotta go. Take some merch, BrandonTaylor.com. <laughs> Tell me, what, do, what, is, what are we rocking with in here? So we Yumminess. got chili, Frito-Lays down there, beans, black olives, cheese, tomato, jalapenos, and sour cream Can't with some chives on the, the top. sour cream. Jesse Are these chives? The beans. <laughs> let's get in there. Let's try some, okay? Right. So let's get a. Do you mix it? Gotta Is that mix the, it that's all the method? Around. Okay. Yeah, because you, oh. you want every little piece in every bite. Kind of twist it all in there. Look at this. Look at the method that we're going at. So we're to grab down under, mix to the top. Mm. Oh, wow. That kind of looks like a oh. heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to lie. All right, you ready to go okay. for it? Let's do it. Let's get a good spoonful, a little bit of everything. I need a bite with a lot of sour cream. Oof. All right, here we go. Oh, that's good. This also started down here, right? In Tennessee? Yep. Petros, mm -hmm. they're at every one of the Tennessee Balls games. They're a big sponsor of it, as you can see from the wall over there. Really interesting taste, a lot of cheese in there. The chili and the beans are real good too. Man, I don't know what I like the best. I think I need to go for a second bite. I need extra sour cream. I like the Fritos because it gives it a nice little crunch. This is not something I don't think you go through the drive-thru and take it home because the chips are gonna get soggy. You need it when it's crunchy. You gotta crunchy. eat it right away. So this is their little sis, which is my girl, and uh, she loves Petros, so. I agree with sis though. I'm like, I could put like a full dollop of sour cream on there. That'd make me real happy. Gotta have some sour cream though. Mm. I, I love like my, Petros. I like my chili to look a little milky. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Definitely some interesting flavors coming out of this spot. It's so good, like seriously. It's weird that this is like a fast food item though. You wouldn't really necessarily think about this as fast food, but it's real good. Mm -hmm. All right, so we got our snack in. Now it's gonna be time for dinner, so we'll see what we're gonna have later. Ooh. But I don't know how much more fast food there is here in the South, so. Got one more. Last, the best for last. Oh God, okay, we'll see what we got. <laughs> Jesse, what's you your slogan that you tell them about the beans? Beans, beans. <laughs> the more you eat, the more you fart. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, you guys, it is dinner time. Behind me, we have Long John Silver's. I have never been here in my life, so let's go see what this is all about. I don't have high hopes, but let's go do it. And before we go in, let me show everybody's <laughs> outfits, okay? So we got Foodie University, the top, the bottom. Foodie University, the top, the bottom. And my man's right here with nothing. Come on, man. All right. Hook me up, man. Hook <laughs> you up. We're going to hook you up. BrendaTaylor.com. All right, let's go. All right, who wants to do the honors? I'll attempt it. Let's see this place. Okay. 
smells like. F what does it smell like? Stink. <laughs> <laughs> do you like our outfits? <laughs> Good. After you, <laughs> Foodie University. <laughs> Have a good one. Have a good night. How you doing? Uh, for here. Okay, so what is something I gotta try? I've never had this place in my life. Honestly, man, I uh -huh. the, the what? The chicken. The chicken. Okay, let's get let's get one chicken. Get the fish and shrimp platter. Yeah, we we'll get a fish and shrimp platter. Twelve, number twelve, or the number thirteen comes. Or fish about tacos. Grand, but I can, uh, Which number were you talking about? The thirteen. Yeah, oh, the right. sampler. Yeah, let's get that. And a hush puppy. Okay, we already got it then. Yeah, more of the sides at. Oh, perfect. Ooh, let's get some macaroni and some. What are you guys thinking for the next one? You messed up on that bean thing earlier. <laughs> what was that thing? I messed up the last time, and it's actually beans, beans, good for your heart. The more you eat, the more you. <laughs> okay, so with that being said, we'll get some green we'll get beans. Some green beans. <laughs> uh, no. Does anyone want a drink? Yeah, okay, let's get a drink. We gotta get sweet tea. Sweet tea, please. Large. Large. We're excited. It's our first time at Long John Silver's. His first time. My first time. I don't know what to expect when it comes down to fast food fish spot. You would think fast food would be the number one pick on the menu. Even no, seafood. seafood. <laughs> oh, wait. Wait, Ch Chessie gets nervous when the camera comes out. She's so nervous. Out. She's, <laughs> and, and poor girl sweating from her kneecaps right now. <laughs> I mean fish. <laughs> tea test. That'll be my thing. I'm a tea girl from the south. I love sweet tea. 10 out of 10. There's like a whole pound of sugar in there. Try it, baby. All right. Mm. A pound of sugar. Yeah, a pound and a half at least. <laughs> she licked the straw before. It's just how I like it. <laughs> why does she always lick the straw? She's looking at where it is. That's why she's trying I to I think I always do that. She's good. <laughs> Oh boy, our knight in shining armor has arrived. Ooh. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Look guys, we're full setting this in the middle of a restaurant right now. We don't give a dang. That's the thing about us. All right, so who here has had Long John Silver's? Just 25 years ago. That, that's how I feel. I haven't seen one of these really ever in my life, besides maybe when I was six. All right. A lot of them are closed. They close a lot of them down. Makes sense, and now I know why. Let's taste it though and find out for sure, okay? So, what should we start with? The, the crumbs? Yeah, definitely a crumb. No way people just eat this. Yeah, the crunchies. Honestly, the little crumbs are interesting. They're greasy, but they do have like a seasoning or something to it. A little mm -hmm. lem lemony, oh. if you will. But it tastes like a bunch of just like Fritos. So, are you guys mm -hmm. cool with lemon on your fish? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They charge for those? I hope not. <laughs> Free. Oh, oh shit, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Mother. All right, let's get this a sample, okay? Now all that popcorn shrimp's mine. Hey, we're all gonna try. Let's all start with the popcorn shrimp, all right? All right, dip, we're gonna dip it in some cocktail sauce right here, and let's see how these taste. Good. Tastes like popcorn shrimp. It does, but the shrimp flavor is little to none. I feel like it almost tastes exactly the same as these crumbs. Mm -hmm. Mine is a little bit of shrimp flavor added in, so interesting. Hush puppy boy, go at it. All right, let's see what Brandon here, this is Brandon, by the way. He's from the south, okay? So he'll let us know how these hush puppies are. Three out of 10. Three? Oh, oh three no. out of 10. Okay. So something too, they're from the south, but they live in Florida, so seafood is their forte. Right. So. But hush puppy is just tough. There's not a lot of seasoning. Yeah, you wanna give one a go? It needs a little bit more flavor. Let's try, we're gonna get. It's soft, but it's not good. <laughs> like okay. All right, let's move on to another piece of this meal. Let's try some mac and cheese, shall we? Uh -huh. You went over to get utensils. I got one fork. <laughs> <laughs> there was only one oh, left, okay, and the okay, guy was okay. checking out over there, right, so I was right. being polite. That, see, that's a sweet southern gal. Okay, so, <laughs> darling. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought you were feeding me too. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just didn't know Brandon was giving me the ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's gotta be like the thickest mac and cheese I think I ever tried to swallow. Let's move on to these bigger fish. So what, was it a white fish? That's your chicken, honey. Chicken. Oh, no, this is, is fish. Chicken? This gotta be. No, nope, that that's is chicken. chicken. Chicken from a fast food fish shop. Okay, I'm catching something here. The only thing that has flavor around any of this food is the batter around it. The chicken itself is like. 
I think it's drier than the chicken you made me that one night. <laughs> <laughs> the batter around it though is that same like citrusy, lemony, sour a little bit breading, but the rest, ugh. I feel bad for that guy. He was real excited. <laughs> he showed how much it had in the cafeteria. You want to buy? You did but? score a bunch of lemon on it. I did actually. You're right. But it had the same flavor as this. They didn't put the same one on the hush puppy though. Look at that little darling face. Now I know why at dinner time this place is completely empty. Ew. It's really shocking that this establishment has stayed in business. But hey more power to them. I'm gonna try one of these big shrimp now. So this thing's look double fried. We're gonna go for Triple it. Triple fried. Triple fried. Anyone wanna grab a shrimp around here? Mmm, try it. I'm gonna try mine as is and see how it is. Oh no, the texture of that is all off. <laughs> That's moist. You can't do it. The shrimp was a no. That was like mush. <laughs> is this also chicken down here? Or is this? Fish. I gotta wash it down with the baby shrimp. Okay, now there here's some fish. fish. Everybody grab a little piece of fish. All right. Let's, let's try the fish. I gotta bring back the childhood memories. And let's, yeah, <laughs> let's bring us back to the glory days of being young. Fair Cheers, y'all. Long drawn silver. Long Cheers. drawn for life. What the hell is growing out of mom? <laughs> I'm just getting some mac and cheese. <laughs> There's nothing distinctive coming out of Long John Silver's. I can honestly say, no offense to the people who are here and love them, they're great people, but I won't be back. Let's rate this place, guys. Give it a two. Two? I was gonna say a two. That's yeah. pretty generous. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna give it a 1.9 yeah. because I don't even feel like it earns a two. So. Popcorn shrimp, I'll give it a five. Popcorn, Popcorn shrimp, shrimp was probably the best thing mm -hmm. out of there. Yeah. yeah. But the rest, I'm sorry. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Before we leave, you guys, I have to. <laughs> Come on, hurry. All right, y'all, so there you have it. We ate at fast food restaurants for 24 hours in the South. I don't think there is any more out here, but if there is, let me know in the comments down below. If you like what we're wearing, you can pick it up at brennantaylor.com. Hit the subscribe right now on this video, and until next time, I love you guys, and I'll see you later. Peace. I'm so exhausted. I'm always nauseous. Praying that I'll stop this.